the real crux of the matter is we're really at kind of a, a watershed moment here. The people involved in the clinical trial do better. I certainly believe that 10 years from now, the approach that we're going to have to cancer is going to be markedly different than what we have today. I'm Rainier Brenchens, MD, PhD. I'm the Deputy Director and I'm the Chair of Medicine at Roswell Park. One of the things about Roswell, which makes it so fascinating, along with probably a handful of other cancer centers, is that there's a balance between clinical care, we offer the best cancer care available, and that that can coordinate with, with research. I'm Igor Puzanov, a Senior Vice President for Clinical Investigation. Usually when a patient actually is diagnosed with cancer, they are looking for the best specialized uh, doctors uh, in their particular cancer. You know, very few people will be diagnosed with cancer and say, I need a clinical trial. They will basically say, I need the best people to take care of me. And uh, usually the best people reside in the centers of excellence like Roswell. What is it that, that uh, about that process that's different from maybe how we understand cancer treatment now? And, and what's different about how Roswell, uh, or is it different at Roswell than say, where you came from or anywhere else that might be doing similar research? Right. The newer therapies are a lot more specific, which means that whether it's a chemotherapy drug or whether it's a cell therapy, which is what I work on, those agents are designed to more specifically go after the Achilles heel of a cancer cell. Is there a particular clinical trial that, that has dramatically improved an individual's life or has really changed cancer care? Dr. Kalinsky, we worked together on several uh, Department of Defense grants in breast cancer, in colorectal cancer, and in melanoma. And, uh, and uh, that's exactly the idea, you know, help more patients. And uh, without a clinical trial, you would not be able to do it. So that's why it's good to think about clinical trials early mm -hmm. before bad things happen. Tell me about what you want to do in the future, what you think will be maybe uh, coming on the horizon that would surprise some people. The goal is to be able to provide virtually any patient that comes to us um, with, with cancer, um, one or another trial that utilizes this type of technology to treat it. But the plan is to really make that, um, a, a, to increase that clinical trial portfolio to one that's far more robust. <laughs>